Mobile robots can operate in unknown environments. Communication is often limited, and the ability to obtain information about their surroundings is critical to their survival. Cameras can provide robots with large amounts of this data quickly and reliably. But our robots have limited processing power and this bandwidth must satisfy several competing requirements. Let us consider a sensor with only 10 pixels. We can spread these over a wide field of view, or they can provide greater detail over a smaller field, but we may miss something. Mobile robots exist in a dynamic environment. If the frame rate is low, motion is blurred. An increased frame rate reduces this and makes object detection and tracking possible. As mobile systems are resource constrained, we must trade one trait for another. Visual acuity for frame rate. Spectral sensitivity for more frame rate. But how can we have it all? Unlike cameras, our eyes do not sample the world uniformly. A high resolution central area called the fovea is supplemented by a low resolution peripheral field. This is formed by an uneven distribution of sensors across the retina. People have been attempting to replicate the biological eye for many years. Some have tried to copy the sensor arrangement in silicon. Others have built systems using multiple cameras. CMOS cameras allow the user to selectively read pixels in real time. This method allows very high frame rates to be read from a standard sensor. I propose to investigate the last method and determine whether synthetic foveal vision using dynamic region of interest techniques can provide similar improvements on a mobile robotic platform. The project will begin with a literature review, which will inform the design process. Implementation will be attempted using an existing robotic platform, and the performance of the peripheral and foveal vision will be measured by various practical tests. Project success will be measured by qualitative and quantitative metrics designed to answer the research question. Can dynamic region of interest improve object tracking for mobile robotic platforms?